I, I would characterize the, the, the regulatory and the central bank community as cautiously optimistic. And the reason I say that is because, and I'm a former regulator, um, they definitely see the power in this technology. They definitely see the potential benefits of what this technology could provide. But they also, by nature, are cautious, and they have to be cautious, because their mandate is to protect the security and, uh, of the overall financial system. They can't make radical changes overnight, because to do so would be so disruptive and potentially dangerous that it could impact those markets themselves. So from a regulatory standpoint, they believe that this technology could really empower them to do their jobs better, but they're working at a slightly slower pace than the commercial banks. One of the things that we have done at R3 is brought them into the fold so that we have regulators and central banks sitting at the same table, either literally at the same table or virtually in, in, a, in, a, in, in a computer environment, working together with private sector entities to develop a set of solutions that work for them both.